Hi, I'm Andrea Anderson Coron and I'm a pediatric neurologist. I'm going to present you a study entitled Functional Parameter Measurements in Ataxia Telangiectasia. The study is going to be published in February 2020 in Developmental Medicine Child Neurology. The study is a joint effort of collaborators at the Shiba Medical Center, including the Pediatric Neurology Unit, Assistive Technology Unit, and the National Center for AT Children in Israel. This study is a retrospective study in which we collected functional parameters of mobility, ADL, and schooling in order to create a natural history and a frame for a functional scale in ataxia telangiectasia. Ataxia telangiectasia, or AT, is a genetic disorder caused by mutations in the ATM gene, which is a central gene in the pathophysiology of, uh, AT of the repair of DNA. Being a gene involved in DNA repair, ATM mutations cause also the neurodegeneration of the cerebellum, as well as immune deficiency, sinopulmonary infections, and malignancies As we said, this is a retrospective uh, chart review of children who were uh, under um, treatment in, at the National AT Center. Unfortunately, from seven, 76 children uh, under, um, uh, followed at the National AT Center, we had information only for 27 patients which were uh, evaluated at the AT clinic as well as in the assistive technology unit, um, unit in our center. As we said, we um, we assessed mobility by using GMFCS as well as functional motor scales. But uh, it was evident from the beginning that these scales are not suited for children with ataxia telangiectasia. For example, children with AT don't use crutches and don't use sticks and seldomly use walkers because of the ataxia. Therefore, in the frame of the FMS scales, we created three scales for mobility for home, school, and outdoors. Uh, in based on our experience with children with ataxia telangiectasia. We gathered functional parameters for ADL and schooling, and we graded them also according to our experience on a five-point scale. And in the end, uh, by pooling together uh, the three AT mobility scales, five of the ADL items and the schooling item, we, um, we uh, created a functional scale for ataxia telangiectasia, which, as you can see, uh, has a good correlation with age. And also, what is most important, it approximates the three stages of the disease. There is an early stage with um, almost plateau, a slow deterioration between the age of two and uh, seven or eight. Afterwards, there is a steep deterioration between eight and 12 years of age. And afterwards, a slower deterioration after the age of 12. Most importantly, since our group was a small group of children, we used a non-parametric regression uh, the Patnechnikov kernel, which is a graphical non-parametric um, method used using the k, k nearest neighbor approximation for curve approximation.